What? What? No. Oh, I'm in a secret. What's up, guys? I'm Drip Drop, and this is Miss Drip Drop, and we're gonna go around and play some games. We hope you guys are doing well, and we want you guys to know that you are loved. And uh, we're gonna go ahead and go out there, play all the games that we can find. Uh, spin the wheel games, card games, what have you, and we're gonna have fun doing it. All right, and then afterwards, if we get any packs, we're gonna open those somewhere. I don't know where, but we're gonna open. Them. All right, so we'll see you later. Good side. <laughs> it's this other side. Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do the board first. Okay. Okay. Ready? One roll. Yeah. Hey guys, we're back in the studio from CollectCon and we got our packs right here that we got from the games that we had played. And uh, we got two Astro Radiance Vivid Voltage and two Japanese packs. We're gonna go ahead and break it off with the Astro Radiance. So I'm, I've been excited to get into these packs just because they've just been sitting around a little bit. And I just wanna know what's in these packs. What did we get from the games that we played? We got Dark Energy, Gutsy Pickaxe, Zisu, Curlia, Magnemite, we got our Ralt, Sneasel, Misdreavus, and it was a fun time playing all those different games. I just wanted to, and I've never went around just playing all the wheel games, spin the wheel games and stuff, so it was pretty cool to do that. We got Hisurian Arcanine. Now the odds are 
not necessarily in our favor because we don't have a whole lot of packs. Um, in the video, you did get to see that we... That was a real cool game where you paid 20 bucks and you just ripped as many packs as you could until you got a hit, which I thought was really cool. And it gave you, gave you a lot of opportunity to pull something sweet. And we pull the full art weird here. The Taut, Cyndaquil, Mantine, Bronzor, and a Reggie Rock. And I've never opened up Japanese packs before. So this is going to be a new thing, a new experience for myself. And I've heard that the Japanese packs are just really good quality. Really actually incredible quality. So I'm excited to see um, if that rings true. We got Nessa, Trumbeak, Pin Pinchur Pinkurchin, Shepard Trubbish. Eevee. And I haven't opened Vivid Voltage in a little bit. Skidoo. Milkery. I need to slow down. Aracuda. And a Terrakion. Alright. So nothing out of the English packs that we got at the uh, at Collecticon. Now we got our Japanese packs. I believe we got Space Juggler and Time Gazer. I think that's what the names are. And maybe I got them backwards a little bit. I'm not sure how to open Japanese packs. Is it just the regular way? And I know there only there's like four. I mean five cards in each pack. And I'm just gonna. There we go. There we go. And I'm not sure how the uh, trick is, so we're just gonna get right into it. Oh, I don't know what this one is. I think it's a form of something. Is it a hit? No, it's not a Hisuian. Our tricks. <laughs> I think that's, is that our rare? Five cards. Five cards. And I mean, to be honest, they don't feel a whole lot different. They don't feel a whole lot different. I think people just have some big biases towards some cards. And we might get, we might pull something here. And I mean, a lot of people don't like the yellow border. A lot of people don't like the yellow border in, uh, in the English yet. So it's, I don't mind the border because it just rings true to Pokemon to me. Or at least my whole life it's been yellow. Alright, and got a switching cart. So nothing in, nothing in the Japanese packs. Nothing in the packs at all, but hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you guys enjoyed the video, give it a like. And I'll see you guys in the next one.